Hi everyone, about a minute on the EV hype, which keeps colliding with reality. You know the EV business is in trouble if Elon Musk is warning about demand, and that's just what he did last week after Tesla uh, reported disappointing results for the third quarter. They missed their revenue targets, missed their profit targets, and the stock price fell by 15% last week. Musk said, here's the quote, if interest rates remain high, it's that, mu it's that much harder for people to buy the car. They simply can't afford it. Okay, so great. So Musk is blaming high interest rates. Well, there's no doubt about that. But the other fact is that EVs simply cost too much. I've been saying this over and over. I've been saying it for years. EVs are being bought by the Benz and Beamer crowd. These are not working class vehicles. The people who buy EVs almost always have another vehicle that they drive, a gasoline car. Um, so the fact that uh, Tesla is now missing targets is no surprise because they've, they're running out of, of, of buyers. Um, but the other point here is that it's not just Tesla. Um, last week, GM said that it was going to delay production by a year of its electric pickup truck. Two weeks ago, Ford said it was uh, ending uh, one of the shifts or the three shifts it was running uh, at a plant where they build the Ford Lightning, their electric vehicle, Lucid, Rivian, or other EV makers, they're also seeing disappointing results. This is all, this was all very predictable. All, all this hype around EVs, it's been around forever. We've been hearing it over and over and over again. And yet the, the reality is that consumers are not lusting after these vehicles. More than half of consumers say they are not interested in EVs and won't buy one. Um, they still cost too much. They take too long to charge. They don't go far enough on a charge. Um, and yet the federal government is just throwing billions of dollars at this business. And now it appears that a lot of the hype is simply just running out. Okay, I'll stop there. Follow me on Substack. Would you? Robert Thanks a lot. See you.